Hello everyone, it's Misla from Dual Core Studio and today I'll explain what dithering is. So in pixel art a lot of people talk about dithering and I'm here to explain what that exactly is. So in the old days uh, when you would need to create a gradient from one color to another or should I say smoother transitions you would use dithering. Why? Uh, this right here is a 4-bit color palette, the original one. So these colors uh, were the only things you could use to create your art piece. So let's say uh, you would want to create a transition. Like right now you have these two colors and tra transition is really obvious. But let's say you want to make it smoother. You would use dithering, which is creating something like checkerboard, checkerboard pattern in order to create smoother transitions. Like this, for example. So in the old days on old CRT monitors, uh, the color precision wasn't that actually great. So these pixels you wouldn't be able to see them for, for, from at least a bit from far, far away because they would blend in the colors would bleed out a little bit and this checkerboard pattern would create uh, like a, something like a third color to create a smoother transition between these two colors okay so that's what dithering is creating a, tra a, a transition between two colors and uh, in the old days it made a lot of sense to do that because when you have only 16 colors to work with and suddenly you can use dithering to create even more colors they were pretty happy but today like I said dithering is used only to create retro style uh, pixel art uh, mostly uh, in like rare cases you really need to use dithering to create uh, smoother transitions uh, and it looks when you do pixel art dithering uh, looks way prettier than actual colors if you use I don't know for example five colors and you use them to dither to create a transition it looks better for a retro style art piece then it would be for example if you use just a gradient tool to make a gradient that has like 50 colors in it i mean it's easier but doesn't look as pretty especially if you want to create a pixel art art piece so yeah uh, let me create a cylinder here to demonstrate what i mean Give me just a few seconds to draw it. Okay, so since I use the blue color, I'm gonna use it again. Um, so let's say the light is hitting uh, right in the middle. So, and I'm gonna work just with these two colors. I'm not gonna use teal color. I'm gonna use these two blue colors and of course the black one for the outlines. So, Let's say the light is hitting right in the middle. And this is a cylinder, so it so the light uh wraps wraps around, should I say, around the cylinder. And if you have only two colors, I'm gonna use stop just this so I can explain a little bit better. So look at this part. I'm going to duplicate it so you can see what I mean. Okay, so let's use Dither. You create first checkerboard pattern. Uh, you have 
many checkerboard patterns that you can use they can be more dense to create um, higher, transi higher transitions but these 50-50 checkerboard pattern or should I say when you have uh, every other pixel is one color and every other pixel is another color that's like 50-50 checkerboard pattern so I'm gonna use black one just a little bit to show my point a little bit better okay so when you zoom out and you have uh, these colors uh, three colors on the left three colors on the right when you look this one use dithering this one doesn't of course I can uh, work a little bit more on this one uh, to create better shading and lighting but let's leave it at this you can even watch on this part or even this part when you zoom out or squint your eyes uh, you can see that the left one has smoother transition from the light all the way as it wraps around I can uh, I mean this is just the basic dithering I can work on this piece a little bit more to create uh, prettier transitions but I'm but I'm gonna leave it just as it is because I'm just I just wanted to explain what the dithering is so I hope that everything is clear if you have any questions about dithering or anything else please leave it down in the comments also if you like this video please like it share it with your friends and don't forget to subscribe until next video see you later